had the terrifying new alien encounter where they're going to be transporting a live alien creature right into the same room with us. Try to contain your enthusiasm. Are you guys scared? No. There's no reason. It's the future. It's science. Let's go. Come on. We've all had our shots. I'll guard the exit. I'm right behind you. Now, you must be wondering how excess tech can help you seize the future. Well, wonder no more. Here to show you how is our most advanced cyberbotic performance unit to date. Ah, welcome, weary travelers, to the great big universe of XS. You may call me Sir, that is S I R which stands for Simulated Intelligence Robotics. 
What do you want, Skippy? No, you may not get out. You're a lucky volunteer. Now, dear friends, you're probably asking, what could the galaxy's leader in sophisticated technology possibly do for me? Well, how would you like to travel anywhere, anytime, at the touch of a button? Science fiction? No. Behold, the XS Series 1000. The first in a complete line of personal and commercial teleportation systems capable of sending bright-eyed biological life forms like yourselves and even lower life forms like Skippy from one place to another instantly. In a moment, I will break down our fuzzy little friend into a mass of molecules, send those molecules through the air above your head, and reconstruct them in the tube over here as good as new. And now, witness for yourselves the wonders of XS teleportation. Phase one of the process has begun. Disintegration into molecular components. Don't worry, it's practically painless. And now the second phase. The molecules are beamed to the receiving chamber where atom by atom we reconstruct our carefree travel. And here's the little skipper now. Oh, shut up, Scruffy. You're not burned. You've just got a healthy glow. Skippy, you, you just reminded me of a feature that I absolutely love. With the mere touch of a button, the entire process can be reversed. Bon voyage. And this is my favorite. It can be suspended indefinitely. My dear friends, you've just witnessed a small sample of the awesome power of XS teleportation. But wait, there's much more. Imagine if the trip were not merely the width of this room, but the breadth of a galaxy, the span of a universe. Well, imagine no more. Because soon one of you will be taking that trip. One of you will seize the future with excess. Bon voyage. Didn't I cover this kind of distance? Again, you are putting We should waste another moment. I couldn't agree with you more. Ready when you are, Doctor. Thank you. The analysis modules above your head will now lower into place. Please remain seated in an upright position with your arms at your sides. When the modules touch your shoulders, they will stop automatically, so remain seated and do not interrupt their operation. I trust you were all impressed with our earlier demonstration in which a living creature was teleported a short distance in total comfort. Now the time has come for one of you to experience something much more remarkable. A journey through interstellar space via XS teleportation. Dr. Phoenix will now analyze your human physiology to determine which one of you is suitable for our demonstration. Dead link online, analyzing now. Yeah, we're going to have to boost the R2 this on large genetics. And we've got our lucky chocolate to whisk across the galaxy. In just a moment, the analysis modules will rise. Please. Spelunk. Cameron Glenn. So, is everything on the schedule? Well, to tell you the truth. What I have is scheduled. Excellent. Just like it a volunteer. It's off. Oh, good. I've been seized. Something you ate? Seized with inspiration. A new idea. Oh, terrific. We're live, right? Yes, very. Hello, everyone. 
I've recalculated our plan. You see, if if we bring one of you here, well, I just can't meet one of you. However, if I'm teleported to Earth, I can meet all of you. Shake each hand and personally answer all your questions about the wonders of excess. I'll be with you in just a moment. Prepare yourselves for an unforgettable encounter. Uh, sir, I, I, I doubt that we're here. Yeah. I remember saying that doubt is the rust of a feeble mind. The only way to seize the future is to grasp the present. Let you go. Grasp the present? Yes. Well, the chairman certainly has a way with words. What do you say, Dr. Smith? Shall we grasp? Well, yeah, grasp, grasp. But first, I have to totally recalibrate. Let's seize, grasp! Okay, Dr. Are you going as fast as I can? Yes, sir. Let's see, man. Be good! Should I do everything? No, no. I didn't want the trajectory where I told you that before you! I didn't know! Another planet in our transmission gap. They must have intercepted the signal. What? What? Wait, I've got something. We could boost the power and send it to Earth. Well, what if it's not him? Force it him. Send him to Earth!
here and there, but I think you get the idea. The potential of excess technology and all of that. We certainly apologize for any inconvenience about that or wrong. It does take time to see the future. Good point. Thank you so much for coming. Please exit out the open doors and don't forget your belongings. The ones that haven't been eaten.